deseo y del dolor. Sentir. In Netflix's Berlin, the title character and his eccentric group of misfits attempt a daring heist. Berlin committed his own heists before to joining the professor's daring scheme to loot the Spanish royal mint. Berlin had pulled off some very risky heists in the past, but they were not nearly as big or as lucrative as what the professor had planned. Berlin, though, was after this rush. He didn't hesitate to give in to his love desires in between. It's clear from his note at the end of the season that he has no intention of changing his ways anytime soon. Spoilers ahead. Berlin's note to Camille hints at their reunion. At first, Berlin appears to be a complicated character, to say the least. He is volatile and unpredictable, which makes it exceptionally hard to pinpoint his intentions. You never know what is going on in his mind, which is also what makes him a sort of wild card. However, all of this facade is stripped away when you get to know him and it turns out that he is not that complex. The only rule that he seems to stick to is the fact that he never holds himself back. He hates and kills with just as much intensity as he loves and cares for, which is once again displayed at the end of this season, with the note he leaves for Camille. Berlin's best laid plans to steal millions of euros worth of jewels were threatened because he fell for the wife of the man he was supposed to rob. Ideally, he should never have let himself out in the open. He should have stuck to the plan and disappeared without a trace, just as it was planned. But then, he sees Camille, and she becomes the bomb for his broken heart. It doesn't take much for the recently divorced, for the third time, Berlin to be completely obsessed with Camille. He believes that he has finally found the love of his life, entirely convinced that this time, it will last. He tells himself he is supposed to end up with Camille, and does whatever it takes to break her marriage, so that she'll choose him. But of course, things don't turn out as he'd imagined. Still, it does nothing to dampen his feelings for her. In the end, when the heist is successful, and the Fuhrer has died down, Berlin and Camille reunite in Madrid. When she tracks him down to the Buenos Aires cafe he'd previously mentioned to her, when she shows up, he isn't surprised. In fact, he anticipated her arrival, which is why perhaps he went back to the cafe. He is also not surprised when she tries to extort money from him. He knows her every move even before she makes it and shows her how useless all her tricks are against him. He does this to show her that he is not obliged to give her the money, even though he still does. What makes things more interesting is that with the money, he leaves her a note. It says, June 23rd, Blue Moon Bar, Singapore, Jatam. Clearly, it's an invitation on his part. He knew that despite the betrayal she might have felt from him, the feelings between them were always real. Neither he nor she made anything up. Even after the revelation of all the secrets, the spark was still there. It didn't die down even when they were separated for months. His giving the time and address to Camille is his way of expressing hope. That even as more months pass by, the feelings they have for each other will remain the same. The proof of it is the fact that he'll be there at Blue Moon Bar in Singapore on June 23rd. The way Camille looks at the note, it feels like she'll be there too. The note is a symbol of optimism for Berlin, and it is another expression of Camille's devotion, which he says has never been anything less. It wasn't dishonesty, as Camille suspected. Nor was it infatuation, as his crew colleagues said. Berlin believes that love is love, no matter how short-lived, and that it is the same deep love he would have for a long-term partner. It doesn't follow that their brief acquaintance doesn't imply that their relationship wasn't genuine. Berlin tells Damien something along such lines at one point, and he means it. He gives Camille that note for this reason. You can be sure he will make it to their June 23rd date.